All right, folks, this is a three bedroom, I believe one bath uh, in the north central area around Delview, uh, Bassey and West Avenue. Super high rental area. A lot of people like living here. You got the lawnmower guy right now on the next door neighbor, but typically it's pretty quiet through here. Just looking at the house, it looks like they did install a new roof. Um, the shingles still need to kind of lay flat. That'll happen with the summer heat. But I could, I could tell that they have uh, a newer drip edge. So I would focus my money on exterior paint and making sure all the fascia looks good. Maybe, you know, jazz up this planter box a little bit. All the windows are solid, but they are old, so they need to be reglazed. That's a handyman kind of deal. All the glaze is pretty uh, old and cracked. I don't see an interior AC, so that definitely needs to you need to consider that. It's about five, six thousand dollars, <laughs> maybe seven thousand dollars because of duct work, but you'll get a bid, right? So let's take a look on the outside here. All right, most of the uh, soffits are pretty good. There's a couple little spots that need to be fixed. So we'll go inside, check it out. <laughs> Okay, so living room, I see a big huge crack right there. I'm pretty sure this is a pure beam house, but we need to verify that. Underneath the carpets is a wood floor. So definitely want to get your wood floor, keep it if you can. This is your kitchen. These cabinets are white. They're solid, but they're like the old aluminum kind. So you could probably keep them if you want to just put a brand new backsplash and countertop on there with new appliances, that'd be fine. Most people are gonna to wanna to knock these walls down, but remember, you're trying to keep this as a rental. So you wanna minimize your repairs. This is a living room, dining room area on the back. There's no door that goes back there. So I would consider putting in a French door or something. And then we'll go back here. This is just a little nook. All right. Backyard's nice and flat, chain link fence all the way around. Let's go ahead and go to the bedrooms. You got one bedroom here on the left. See some drywall repairs. The closet looks good. This looks almost exactly like my first rental on Meek. Here's your bathroom. It's the old style. Definitely want to go ahead and get it redone. You don't have to. I mean, it could be cleaning and functional. But I would consider going ahead and doing a remodel there. So this is two bedrooms, one bath on this side. Let's see if there's a, I guess you could consider that. A, no, you'd have to wall that off. So it's really two bedrooms, one bath, but lots of square feet. So you can turn it into a bedroom. This is your garage. It's not converted. A lot of people are converting their garages in this neighborhood. This is your brand new water heater, if you can see that. Looks pretty darn new. So there's your door to the outside. This is like an extra, I don't know, storage unit or bonus room or something. But we'll walk outside real quick. We got some storage and a little fireplace. Again, you got the window units everywhere. Tenants are not going to really want that. 
in this neighborhood, most people are putting in a new AC unit. Again, because of the backyard's pretty nice, I'd consider putting in some kind of a French door or something. Anyway, that's it folks.